I built a robot leaf blower, and we're gonna find out if it's faster than a rake or a lawnmower. I hate leaves. Even though the fall season is beautiful, it means my yard gets covered in a literal ocean of leaves. Normally, I clean it up myself, but I'm feeling extra lazy this year, and I'm an engineer, so let's come up with a creative solution. A few months ago, I built a remote-controlled snowcat. It's the design of a fellow YouTuber named RC Test Flight, and it's perfect for navigating rough terrain. If we can find a way to put a leaf blower on it, I would be able to clean up my yard from the comfort of my couch. Interestingly enough, this particular leaf blower has a couple of indents, so I 3D printed matching clips. After attaching the clips to the snowcat's frame, I attached a leaf blower to the clips, and look at how nice the connection is! It's almost like the creators of this leaf blower wanted me to do this. I also zip-tied a servo to the throttle of the leaf blower so I can control the airflow. The whole contraption is really simple and makes leaves quiver with fear. Here's some footage of it annihilating some leaves. But how fast is it exactly? It's time for a test. I marked off 9 square meters of cones, and we'll time how long it takes to clear the square. We'll also compare it to a rake and a lawnmower. Let's start with the rake. It took a minute and 40 seconds to clear the square with a rake. It was also pretty exhausting. So let's make a new square and see how long it takes the robot to do it. If you're enjoying the video by the way, you should consider subscribing. I post fresh engineering content on a weekly basis. Wow, it just blew the rake out of the water with a time of 19 seconds. Finally, let's make a new square and clear it with a lawnmower. The lawnmower got second place for a time of 48 seconds, but only because it was less maneuverable. The mower also has one big advantage over the leaf blower, and that's the ability to carry the leaves and dump them somewhere else. So really, I'd say it's a tie between the robot and the lawnmower. There is one improvement I would like to make to this robot, and I would like to give it GPS. It would be really cool to map my yard out and have it automatically sweep through it on its own. This would allow me to sleep while leaf blowing. Like I said before, I post weekly engineering content, so if you want to to follow along with this project, don't forget to subscribe. See you soon and thanks for watching.